since the dawn of time. Evil has stirred in the darkness, waiting for the forces of good to show weakness. Appearing in many different forms, wearing many different masks. A timeless force, a corruptive darkness, the evil of all evil, Makuta. Hi guys, I'm Corvin. I'm Nick. I'm John. And welcome to the Makuta Building Competition. <laughs> what was that? Uh, evil, evil laugh? That's not an evil laugh. <laughs> <laughs> what are you guys doing? That's not evil enough. Come on, let's do it together. Okay. One, two. <laughs> 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 All right, so enough of that. We've got Makuta here. Makuta is a, an ancient evil and he's got uh, all these different forms in which he can appear. And this is how we portray them in Journey to One. Even if that means the Toa will never know their true power, and darkness will roar forever. When I built Makuta, I just wanted a huge brawler who could pummel Toa into the dust if he wanted to. So like he's big, he's got the giant wrist blades, he's got the energy armor, he's got the uh, shadowy body types, and of course he's got like all the uh, golden extra bits. He's got blades on the back, so even if you sort of get him into a bear hug from behind, there's nothing you can do. He's going to win, he's going to pummel you into the dust. But it's not the only version we have. So a lot of these elements uh, from this awesome build with the, the gray blades and the, 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 the color scheme, um, we kind of carried it over to the, the final version that we used for the animation that we have here. He's a, a giant, uh, giant shadow titan with these amazing weapons. He's got a spinning drill. Oh, that's a cool trick. And uh, these extendable blades in his other arm. That will be an extremely useful weapon. Yeah. Um, so the idea is that he's just this massive hulking brute. And here you can see one of the model built by our intern. He make a Makuta in his basically emperor looking on his throne. Very, very pleased with himself, just lounging away in his throne of skulls. There must be 150 in there. Well, Not sure um, the chair is very comfortable, but I don't yeah. think it matters. It's all about the feel. I want to. I kind of want a throne of skulls, don't you? Mm, yeah, definitely. Fit That's nicely it. in my apartment. It really ties the room together. We also have the Overlord model which is Makuta here. And he has a star for collect the different masks from the tour. And he got a different battling weapons on the other side. He has a side weapon here. And he's got these awesome wings that he can fly around and destroy the whole... Oh, nowhere safe now. Uh, nowhere safe from him. He's, yeah. he's just like, I have both my hands full, yet I still need to have this other blade you need as well. Extra I just blade. have it on my you side. You never know when you, you need it. Do you want wings? Of course you want wings. You want wings every time. Yeah. Now I've seen all these awesome models, now it's the time for us to see yours. It's easy really, uh, you built the evilest model you could possibly imagine. Uh, you take a picture of it and share it with us on Rebirth.com. And the winner will walk away with the most amazing Bionicle prize you've ever seen. Check it out. A huge box of mean, buildable action. It includes the entire Bionicle 2015 and 2016 retail range. That is 35 sets of pure awesomeness. <laughs> so, in addition to this awesome prize, uh, the best of the best will also receive a limited edition exclusive signed Bionicle art book. Also, between all other participants, we're going to draw one lucky person who also gets the art book. So, there are really no excuses. Get building. You have until September 5th. And for more information, you can go to uh, rebrick.com and you can see all the details up there. So, good luck and happy building. We can't wait to see what you come up with. I dare you.